Hello everyone, today we're doing a book review on The Sellout by Paul Vitti. Uh, first of all, I want to shout out my grandfather for gifting me this book for my birthday. Or actually, it was my birthday? Christmas, I believe. Yeah, shout out to him for getting me this book for Christmas. First, I definitely want to start off by saying this book was interesting. Essentially, it's about a young black man living in L.A., who grew up with a abusive father who was kind of a mad scientist, essentially. He did a lot of experiments on him that were definitely very abusive and very inappropriate. And a lot of them related to race and kind of promoting the white supremacist agenda, essentially. And that sentiment and philosophy shaped this young man's character. The young man's name is Bon Bon. So we open up with the father actually being killed by the police in a accidental attack and from there that kind of shapes Bon Bon's whole narrative throughout the whole entire book. We actually learned that Bon Bon is trying to get his childhood town added back on the map and become a town again in LA. His town that he grew up in was actually absorbed so it lost essentially its own identity, culture, and independence and he is trying to get that town back and also trying to reinstate segregation and he is a black man so it's very interesting almost funny at times that we're actually learning about a black man who believes in racism who believes in this system of segregation and he is really promoting it he is going around the city and recruiting people and it's it's a funny book and but it's also really really sad you know it has you sit down and think why this even existed to begin with in traditional segregation in America, but also we have a book about a black man who's promoting it and and why he thinks it's actually a good idea. And in a way, like as you're reading, you're like, well, that's a, that is interesting. That is interesting. But it's a book that would really have you think in a very interesting way. I highly recommend people to read this book if you just want to learn more about, I would say, black America, but also learn about segregation in a different perspective. And I'm not saying this perspective is a good perspective. This is actually a fictional book, but it gives you more of an analysis to actually break down what racism actually means in America, especially coming from a quote unquote black man who was abused as by his father and grew up in a suburb and is trying to bring that back. I definitely think it's a fascinating book and I would definitely check it out. Thank you.